What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Ah, uh, let's check out a new game here. And the controls are a bit wonky. Hold on one second. Okay. I'm trying to get the controller to work. The Xbox controller, but it doesn't seem to be doing anything. I'm um, checking out Fractured Mind. It is a... Kind of like a weird... Horror game that's... It's like a demo. Okay. Yeah, the... It doesn't look right in VR. I mean, it's playable, but it's just, it just looks a little strange. It's got this fisheye lens. I don't even know if it's recording properly. I have no choice but to play with a keyboard or mouse, which I'm not really exactly um, adept at. Because I know I'm a... I'm a little bit mentally challenged. I own a PC. What the hell is this? Oh, that's creepy. I own a PC, but I don't know how to play with a keyboard or mouse. I know. Stupid, right? Well, that's creepy looking. Okay. Yeah, we're uh, off to a great start here. But yeah, the scaling is off. Things are kind of miniature-ish. There we go. It's E. Okay. Ha. There is the gun. All right. Um... Do I press E? Oh! Easy there. <laughs> it looks like my hands look so tiny. That's crazy. Yeah, this looks bizarre in VR. Definitely, when the full game comes out, I hope it's going to be like completely uh, gamepad con uh, controller compatible. Open up, open up. And it's not opening up. Okay. What am I supposed to do here? It's a body cam, but it's not really in my body, is it? It's in my head. I heard this game is built on UE5, Unreal Engine 5. And it's got DLSS automatically applied and even frame generation. So I got this weird warning in the UE VR app or the mod. It says bright red friggin' warning sign label or whatever you want to call it something about the frame generation is automatically on oh there we go that's how you do it okay yeah I heard this game is sort of like PT-ish except you have a body cam and um, that's about it I don't know have no clue what this game's about Okay, this is getting a bit repetitive. Oh, come on. All right. Just like PT, there's I have to do something. All right? I'm supposed to trigger or activate some kind of like event of some kind. I'm guessing.
It's, I don't know. I don't know if I can play any longer. It's making me dizzy. It feels like I'm cross-eyed. Okay, the gun's not working. Alright, maybe I'm supposed to... This sounded different. Look at a sign. Always remember to pay attention to small details. You'll need five letters to unlock... Oh, okay. You'll need five letters to unlock the padlock. They are hidden throughout the game. You'll need to complete the... The what? The body before proceeding to the ending. This totally doesn't break the fourth wall. Ah, not wasting your bullets. So, I have the bullets. Okay, I don't get this. Romania. Looks more like a New York subway. Shouldn't know, I live in New York. Haven't been in the subway in ages. So much friggin' crime is happening all around New York, so... It's another excuse for me to stay inside. I only go out for beer and cigarettes and food, that is it. I live a very reclusive, sad life. Hence my name, The Reclusive Gamer. Alright, so I don't know what the hell I'm supposed to do here. I'm not really enjoying myself right now. Like I said, it feels like I am completely cross-eyed. Mental health. Oh, perfect. Right up my alley. Rules of conduct. No smoking, no alcohol, panhandling. Maybe it's, it's this map, right? No? It's the crouch. Ah, reload. Stop it. But why does he keep firing? What the hell? Yeah. All right. I'm gonna turn. <laughs> I think it's uh, it's time to call it quits. It's getting redundant. This subway car just keeps repeating itself. Alright. Yeah, well, I don't even know if I should... I don't even know if I should even upload this. It's not even worth it. But, I don't know. I'm bored, so maybe I will. Alright. See you later. Sorry for the short, brief gameplay. Uh, if anybody has any suggestions, leave it in the comment section. All right. See you in the next one. Bye bye.